A very good morning to all. This is your Dr. Puru Dhawan and as promised, I am back with a brand new topic related to kidney disease. Today, I will be sharing my thoughts on what are renal cysts, what are the causes behind them. With this, I will be also explain the sign and symptom that an individual experience with the development of this renal cyst and what preventive measures should be taken. So let's start with understanding renal cyst. In simple words, a renal cyst is a fluid filled sac. The exterior wall of this cyst is usually thin and fluid has a water like consistency. Such cysts are often called simple cysts with their occurrence being relatively common in older adults. The number can range anywhere from 20% in the age group of 40. Kidney cysts form when a nephron tubule expand and fill with the Fluid. There is always possibility that an individual can have multiple cysts in either one or both kidney at a different interval or at the same time. Any visible symptom do not usually accompany simple cyst. Still, the probability of the symptom increases is always there as these cysts grow in size if enough precaution is not taken. In normal kidneys, one or two solitary cysts are frequent. Normal kidney might develop up to 5 cysts in few occasions. Once renal cysts start to increase in size, they can cause problems like pain in the lower back or fever or high level of creatinine and urea. The size of the cyst matters a lot as in some cases, they can burst to cause immense pain and even lead to serious health ailment. Two types of renal cysts are prevalent. Apart from simple renal cysts, another variation of the cyst can develop which come under the category of polycystic kidney disease. This is very different from simple renal cyst. As an individual affected by polycystic kidney disease usually has clutters of the cyst which leads to the disfiguration of the kidney and can even lead to cyst formation in other organs such as liver. The cause behind simple renal cyst are not entirely known but age play a significant factor in their development. But in case of polycystic kidney, the cause of the cyst formation is known and that is genetic. If your father or mother is suffering from polycystic kidney disease, the probability of having you, the same disease is very much high. So the cause of these two cysts are entirely different. One third of adults over 70 are thought to have at least one uncomplicated renal cyst. However, having more than a simple cyst in each kidney is usual. When a person suffers from simple cortical cyst, if the size of the cyst increases, it may cause complications like hypertension and renal dysfunction. Simple kidney cysts are virtually typically asymptomatic. They are labeled simple because they are slim possibility they will grow into something more serious. Yet certain cysts with thicker wall can be linked to kidney cancer. Mild kidney cysts that cause symptom or obstruct the normal passage of blood or urine to the kidney may require treatment. Now let's move to the sign and symptom of in case of simple cortical cyst. As I said earlier, simple renal cysts do not cause any specific symptom that may be visible. But as the, these cysts grow in size, they may cause obstructive symptom due to the pressure they put on the surrounding structure. This may lead to complications like hemorrhage, infection, as well as rupturing of the cyst. However, an individual can have signs like fever, tenderness between the ribs and the pelvic region, and the affected urine flow, which is rarely seen. With growing size, often these simple cysts turn into a complex one, which do not have thin wall. Instead, complex renal cysts have thick walls compared to the simple one and are filled with solid material instead of fluid. Cyst can enlarge and cause upper back discomfort. You may bleed from the cyst and have blood in your urine at times. Infection can arise, causing pain while passing urine or fever with sweating and backache. They can be difficult to cure. These cysts can often cause side effects such as high blood pressure or can be infected causing pain, tenderness or blood in urine. So let's move to the treatment part of the simple cortical cyst. So we at Shriyas, if the patient is suffering from simple cortical cyst without any presence of protein in urine or high blood pressure, 
there is usually no treatment that need to be done. In case of presence of protein in urine, it gets clear that the kidney are being damaged because of the cortical cyst. If the patient is suffering from PKD, where the kidney size increases from 10 cm to 20 cm, it is essential to treat both the cyst and the kidney to prevent further damage. Further, with the polycystic kidney disease patient, extra care has to be taken because the cysts are much more complex. Because it is an inherited disease, often taken early treatment for the cyst can prevent complication to arise in future. You can use some home tricks to control the growth of the kidney cyst. To begin with, try to stick to a low sodium diet. Kidney are important in the elimination of excess fluid from the body. When you ingest a lot of salt, your body starts retaining fluid, putting extra strain on your kidneys. High sodium food should be avoided, including canned goods, table salt, shellfish, and cured meat. A low fat, high fiber diet is also beneficial as a kid natural kidney cyst therapy. This diet free regimen can lower blood pressure, benefiting the kidney and reducing the PKD consequences. You should also cut back on your protein consumption. Protein may be stressful on the kidney, causing them to work considerably harder. In real situation, a cyst can cause kidney damage. Now it is important to follow all the steps mentioned in the video to make sure that you don't go through all these medical issues in your life. Towards the end, I want to thank everyone for watching this video and I hope that I was able to answer your queries related to your kidney cyst. If you still any question left unanswered, you can ask them in the comment section of the, this video and our team will be more than happy to answer them. See you all next time. Till then, take care.